10 most profitable businesses you can start today. In our continuing series, um, we're gonna talk about painting, um, but more specifically, the numbers behind painting. Uh, these are the two brands that we've been working on for the last 12 years, and obviously the pictures need to be updated, and hopefully next time you'll see the updated pictures. But let's talk about the numbers behind it, the, uh, <clears throat> the painting company. What are the, typically the people what people do when they start a painting company? They hand out flyers, they do a pay-per-click campaign, or they do a door knocking campaign, <clears throat> or they depend on just referrals. And to me, that's the slowest way to grow a company. So what is the fastest way to grow a company? I, I would say doing it in major volume. And the reason why we focus on on uh, truck wraps is because it's really important to be part, to be known as a trusted part of your community. If you're not known as a trusted part of your community, you're going to blow you know, millions of dollars over time on online marketing and pay-per-click campaigns. So from my perspective and the testing we have been doing for the past 12 years, it's more important to be seen as a trusted part of your community and hence the truck wraps. So to use some numbers that we, we have for the roofing industry, we typically, when we rent these vehicles to courier companies, we uh, we typically get between 14 and 20 leads per day per truck. So, and typically the uh, the leasing or the um, the rental companies, the delivery companies, the courier companies pay around 70 or 80% of the lease. So these, the cost per lead is pretty low. But I want to update that. We've been testing a new strategy and I find that it works a lot better. And typically what, what we do is we rotate the people in the office. They volunteer to go out for two hours at a time because we don't want tired drivers on the road, right? And when you have a loudspeaker on the back and you, you're, you're you know, telling jokes, or at least the pre-recorded message is telling jokes. And we, we're uh, hired the, an actor that can do Trump's voice and 20 other voices. And uh, and really, it's to entertain the traffic, the people in, stuck in traffic with traffic trivia or jokes or jokes of the day or or anything entertaining. And we talk to people like Mr. Gray Audi that's uh, 15 cars behind me. What do you think of that question or what do you think of that joke? So it makes it sound like, again, in Trump's voice, it makes it sound like we are live right? We're not. The driver's focusing on driving or the driver's focusing on making phone calls um, and catching up with whatever he needs to do. Um, <clears throat> but to give you an example, Highway 401 here in Toronto has about 400,000 vehicles per day. 400,000 vehicles per day. So do you believe these vehicles could get people's attention, especially if there's a loudspeaker or music or something going on uh, to get that attention uh, from both sides of the highway? And I believe we can, because again, we're receiving between 14 and 20 vehicles per day from our roofing company. So I believe because Roofing is is something that you don't want to do, right? It's an expense that you haven't budgeted for, and it's not something you're eager to do. Painting, on the other hand, I'm not saying people are eager to paint their home, but they're more likely because it's it's going to create a, a new ambiance for their home. It's going to create you know a more lively feel, and they're going to be happier to paint than to replace the roof. They get no benefit by replacing the roof. Yes, they're increasing the value of the home, but they're really not getting any benefit. Painting the home with you know the 15 most popular colors today, because we suggested uh, these are colors that were picked by the top designers in, in Canada or USA, they're more likely to repaint their home or repaint their bedroom or the main floor, or whatever that is, right? So people are more likely to repaint than they are to replace the roof. So out of 400,000 vehicles, and again, you're gonna switch people in the office or you're gonna hire retirees to work, you know, two hours at a time or three hours or four hours at a time to, you know, create a loop on, you know, major six lane highways that have 400,000 vehicles. So the goal is if you can get, let's say 1% of these people to say, wow, you know, that's, that's different. 
and and there's a call to action and all these vehicles have a website and that's a call to action go to the website request a quote or go to the website watch the videos and uh, eventually request a quote so that's the goal do you think out of 400,000 vehicles one percent of these people might know someone who is going to be moving who is you know needs to update their house or wants to update their house and if in the recording we say you know have your whole house painted instead of paying twenty thousand dollars you're paying 250 dollars a month are they more likely to get their house painted whether it's inside or outside we want to focus more on the inside now out of four hundred thousand vehicles one percent is four thousand people one tenth of one percent is 400 people per day what is the likelihood of someone saying, yeah, let's get a quote. Let's figure out, you know, what can they do? What are the top 15 colors for this year? You know, and uh, and if we can get them to ask questions like that, not only, you know, with the truck wraps, with the videos that you create on TikTok and, and social media and so on. And these are going to be index sites, which means we're going to unite, uh, let's say, a thousand painting companies, smaller painting companies around North America to each create a landing page now this uh, this website or these websites we're going to have competing websites and the winner ultimately wins we're going to run with the winner but we're going to test two or three uh different websites and the winner obviously leads now if if you're if you're doing the same thing in your city and you have you know two or three trucks on the road and you're producing you know 15 to 20 leads per day per truck and, and again, 14 to 20 is roofing. I believe the lead count will be higher for painting because you're, uh, as I said before, you're more likely to paint your house than you are to replace a roof. You know, a roof needs to be replaced every 10 or 20 years. You're gonna paint every time you move in and out and you're gonna, you're, you're gonna update a bedroom or a living room or whatever it is every five years, 10 years, let's say. Uh, so you're more likely to paint. So these index sites, they're going to have a thousand landing pages they are going to be producing free leads to you for at least a year uh, before you have to pay anything. And the question is, if you doubt my numbers, if you don't believe you're going to get, let's say, 15 or 20 leads per day, what would be the cost for you to test them? Right. You're going to think, OK, I'm going to have to pay you know, a lot of money for for a truck. You know, the truck wrap is forty five hundred dollars uh, plus. So you're looking at around five thousand dollars for the truck wrap. Uh, and what would it cost? Now I have to pay people to drive up and down the highway and so on. But let's say let's say you did test it, because as, as if you watch some of the other videos, I've, I've shown you how we did a three truck deal and leasing companies generally want 10 percent down. We lease everything because we want to take the tax advantages. Um, they want 10 percent down, but we negotiated and we do a large volumes with them where we don't put anything down. In fact, we include the five thousand dollars per truck you know, truck wrap in the lease so we have one low monthly payment um and like i said courier companies will rent these vehicles because they always need vehicles right they always need vehicles if you look at um you know the amazon delivery truck they're always rental trucks in this area always because they want to make sure that they have the business before they start buying trucks so they will rent them so rent them your trucks but I, I believe if you allow your people in your office or you hire retirees, you know, at 15 or $20 an hour to drive up and down the highway is a better bet. Or when they have lunch, they sit in front of a supermarket to say, hey, I am your neighbor, do business with me, right? And the brand creates trust with future potential clients before they meet you. So, um, those are some of the numbers and and what it's going to cost you to test is, is going to be basically nothing because the leasing company actually gives us money back at the end of the lease and the lease is around 900 dollars per month so what would it cost if it doesn't work then you have a work vehicle anyways right so i would love to hear your questions comments below can you get one percent of people to look at your truck and say wow that's that's amazing maybe i should give them a call and if they see that vehicle 10 or 15 or 20 times you know each time they go to work are they more likely to to uh, give you a phone call or send a request a quote from the website 
We'd love to hear your questions, comments below. Also, join us live every day at 12 noon, where we talk about business strategies. We'll talk soon. Take care.